so uh, so with uh, with a block, it, you'd be able to hold seventy three thousand lithium dust. You'd be able to hold a lot of it. So we should probably do something like I don't know, maybe maybe let's do something like ten thousand. So greater than or equal to. Wait, no. Um, we need an integer. 10,000, please. So, greater than or equal to. So, if uh, so if we have more than 10,000 lithium dust, then output a redstone cycle. Which would be really good. Oh, shoot. Which one's which? Um, 18... 19, so it's this one. So give me this. And then Redstone Rider will go ahead. This one. Sweet. Um, so yeah, that should, this should be pretty, uh, it should be pretty straightforward. So let's go ahead and Redstone Link. And we'll do uh, Lithium on this channel. Because why not? Then let's go over here, and maybe I should go ahead and just turn off the... Uh, let's go ahead and turn off the, the Wither Spawner. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and turn off the Wither Spawner for the time being, so that, uh, so that way the uh, redstone signal turning off isn't going to be weird. Okay, so... Oh, whatever. It, it'll be it'll be fine if we get one more. It's just you know. Okay, so let's grab let's grab this. Maybe with that, and then give me the level emitter. And let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and get back to the Nether Star one, so that way I can set that up as well. Uh, dink, there. Let's do link. Let's see. Nether star. And we do this. And it's active again. Which I guess makes sense, just because... Uh, hang on. Yeah, I mean, it's active again just because I set it on run on pulse, so... Yeah, run with no redstone. And I could do the same thing with the lithium... Uh, I could do the same thing with the chemical crystallizer. We could do... Inverted. So... We could do this, set it to receive, and then lithium, lithium. And we should be good, I think. Wait, hang on. Uh, let's see. Give me that. Uh, give me that redstone upgrade, because I kind of don't want that anymore. And let's uh, grow me back to normal size. And let's go ahead and uncraft. Um, let's, I can I can go ahead and put my uncrafting grinder over here. Or hold on, where is my uncrafting grinder? Did I did I like leave it somewhere? Oh, it's in my backpack. Okay, we're good. So let's go ahead and put this here. Uh, just give give me all that stuff back, please, because uh, yeah. There we go. That's better. So we should be we should be good. Let's just I might as well just go back into here and double check. But yeah, this is true now. Oh wait, no, that's the Nether Stars. Um. Yeah, I need to look at the right thing. Still false, so... Okay. Yeah, we should be, uh, we should be 
good for the time being. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully hopefully this hopefully this works. Hopefully this works pretty well. I I would I I would be a really big fan if this if this if this worked like incredibly well. So, yeah. Okay. So, now that we have uh, now we have that stuff going. So, display panel will work good. The ender chest, uh, we will do something with that later. Um, but for now, um, kind of, uh, I'm kind of thinking, I'm kind of thinking I should go to the end again and like summon the ender dragon a few times. Hold on. So, how about how many shulker shells? Uh, we don't have a lot of shulker shells because I kind of want to get the, I kind of want to get uh, the uh, the uh, blue heart canisters that I need for uh, for my. Uh, yeah, so I kind of want to get the blue heart canisters that I need for my heart amulet and for the vitality blade, uh, which requires which requires more shulker shells and more green hearts. Green hearts are extremely annoying to come by, by the way. So yeah, how how about I just uh, meet you in the end and we will uh, go from there? Well, that's right. I never defeated the Ender Dragon in the series. Uh, I mean that's fine though. Oh wait. No, wait, I thought I did. Hold on. Mm. Whatever. Whatever, I can I can defeat the other dragon. Shoot, where the heck is my bow? Here it is. Yeah, I mean we can defeat the Ender Dragon. Wait, no, uh, we can defeat the Ender Dragon right now. It'll be fine. There we go. Dude, what the heck? You'd think using a bow in it, it, you'd think using a bow in Destiny would uh, would train me for using a bow in Minecraft, but apparently not. Okay, yeah, this is uh There we go. It only does it the first time, I believe. But yeah, you know, it's fine. Wow. Oh wow, that's trippy. Uh, <laughs> it's moving with me. Oh wow, that is really trippy. But hey, I mean, this is uh, that's pretty good. Oh wait, oh beheading gives me a dragon head. Ooh, what the heck? And this just, it just went into my insightful crystal. Okay, that's a thing. I, I mean, I mean, that's what I expected, but I, wow, there's a lot of experience in there. All right, so uh, give me a torch, I guess. Where's, where's that torch? Uh, okay. Well, where'd the egg go? Hey, what the? There's another Ender Dragon? There, there's another Ender Get back here. Stop playing that music. Alright, well, um. I need to find the egg. Where'd the egg go? Oh, wait, it's over there. What the heck? Why did it see the egg teleported over there when it really went over here? And technically, I don't need a torch. It's just a little bit easier. Okay, so that's the first. Uh, that's the first one. Oh wow! You okay? Uh, okay, so these do not. Uh, these do not get consumed very quickly. You can't even shift click. Oh wait, it's eight. That's right. I forgot. I forgot. Mini utilities is weird with compressing. It was compressing the pearls, so yeah. Okay, so we can uh, so we can yeah, we can also just uh, summon the Ender Dragon again. So, oh, nine binary shader, sweet. 
All right, so we're gonna need uh we're gonna need end crystals. Which I mean, in this in this pack they aren't changed at all, which is good. Um, also, I kind of want this to be like any forged glass, not just like glass glass. So be right back. Okay, I made the change, but I didn't reload my instance just because. Yeah, whatever, it's fine. So let's take a look at green hearts. I need nineteen or I need eighteen more of those. So we're gonna need seventy two end crystals. Yeah, which is just great. Uh, so let's see. I have Ender. Do I have enough? 72. I do have enough, surprisingly. Uh, I'm going to need to set up a Blaze Spawner at some point, which is a good thing I have an Apotheosis Blaze Spawner. But yeah, let's go Let's go ahead and get some End Crystals created. Uh, how, much, how many Gas Tears do I have? Surprisingly plenty. All right, and crystal. All right, come on. There we go. Oh wait, no, I don't have plenty. Oh crap, uh, let's see, uh, catalyzing gland. Nope, need two of them. Or is it three of them? It was three of them, all right. So we need 72 of these, right? So I think that. Let's see, end crystal. Yeah, I think that's correct. So yeah, let's go. Let's go ahead. Uh, let's go ahead and just uh, resummon the Ender Dragon. Uh, I'll just uh, I'll play through the I'll play through resummoning animation once just to show you. Hey, I'm actually doing the Ender Dragon, and then uh, I'll just. I'll just, I'll just be right back as soon as I fight the other dragon. So, yeah. Dude, the resummoning animation, very good. I'm, I'm actually really glad there is a way to resummon the other dragon in vanilla, because previously you could only do that with Draconic Evolution. So, yeah. Dude, that is amazing. All right, I'll be right back. I'm glad it doesn't have to be perfect because I accidentally put this one a little too far, but uh, yeah, <laughs> it works if it's not perfect, which is good. Okay, I just killed all the Ender Dragons that I needed to kill, and I have 213 levels of experience. That includes all of the experience pearls that dropped from the Ender Dragon. Uh, the Ender Dragon didn't drop uh, experience pearls as often as I thought it would, but you know, it's fine. I'm not gonna worry about it. Oh, it's an Enderman head. Uh, I was wondering why that didn't show up properly, but yeah, whatever. All right, so now in order to make this, we need shulker shells. Let's see, yeah, we're gonna need we're gonna need quite a few of those. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go over to the end city over here, and uh, I'll be right back. Well, there's an orange bar shulker, or there's an orange mob shulker here. I wonder, uh, wonder, is it gonna give me anything good? Maybe. Let's find out. As, long, uh, as soon as it opens up again. Alright, what'd you give me? Ooh, a shield. You will leap back when blocking in melee. Huh, interesting. I mean, I also got a mob swab of, uh, of shulkers, just in case I can't find any, because I've not been lucky with finding shulkers. So, yeah. Alright, well, I got all the shulker shells that I needed, so let's head home. Pause my experience. It disenchant some things. Oh, that is the wrong. Uh, that's the wrong order, actually. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll just uh, go ahead and store all my experience, disenchant some things, and uh, yeah, I I have a lot of stuff to disenchant because uh, because Endermen were actually kind of kind to me when uh, when it came to giving me stuff to disenchant. I don't know why, but they were. So yeah. All right. Uh, put this in bag mode for a second. I want to put. Nope. Never mind. I do not want to put those in there. Not bag mode anymore. Um. All right. Give me just one second. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and just uh shard uh, like salvage these two things just because like, you know, they're uh, uh they'll give me some good stuff. I'm hoping for a lot of Godforge pearls from this. Okay, three is pretty good. Three is pretty good from that. Now, can I, like, arc furnace this? 
No. Now, what about the netherite boots? No, I cannot. That sucks. Okay, well, uh, I guess I guess I'm keeping. I, I, I mean, the diamond stuff can be pulverized into diamonds, so it just depends on how many diamonds I have. Yeah, you know. What about the? Uh, that's right. This can't. This can't do anything either. All right. Well, uh, leather can be cutting. Uh, can be cut into leather. Or compressed iron boots, I guess. I don't know. Hold on. Yeah, whatever. Okay, I got the 20 green heart canisters that I need. Now I just need to upgrade these to blue, which is going to require... Let's see, how many emeralds do I have? Plenty. But it also required netherite blocks. So, yeah. That's going to that's gonna be a problem. Because I don't have a lot of netherite right now. Which means we're probably, which means we're gonna need to go, we're gonna need to go to the Nether and uh, Digital Mine. And so uh, also, I'm in my compact machine because I need a nickel, and this thing still hasn't gone through all the ores that I have. So, yeah, that's a problem. We still don't have enough stuff, and uh, and also and also I don't have the power to be able to uh, to run this at full blast. So. Not amazing, but it's fine for the moment. Point is, we need to go to the nether, so... Hello? Oh my god. There we go. Oh no, I need to keep this here. This can go in here. And then here's my... That stuff. And look at that, my uh, my Nether Star thing is working. Okay, so we still don't have enough. Uh, huh? Let's see. Hold on. That's weird. Why is it? Why is it not? Why is it not localized? Huh? Odd. Oh, it's whatever. All right. Let's just go to the nether. Let's just go to the nether and get some ancient debris. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna need to come right back though because this is gonna take a very long time to find. So bear back, dude. I need 637 more. <laughs> oh my god. I need a lot of netherite scrap in order to make in order to make all the netherite that I need. So yeah, that's gonna take a very very long time. Maybe I should maybe I should just come back in like ten minutes or something. I have enough netherite. Holy crap! <laughs> I I did not I did not think I'd ever have this much netherite in my entire career playing Minecraft. But uh, yeah, I mean we're left with eighty one scrap, which means we're gonna have to go look for some more if we're gonna need a lot of netherite. So yeah, maybe I should also uh, maybe I should also put speed upgrades on that so that way I'm not waiting forever. But maybe, maybe it's... Uh, yeah, actually, let's... Yeah, let's go ahead and put speed upgrades on it, because why not? I mean, this is... It's gonna take a while for this to be ready to accept a new metal anyway, so... Alright, let's... Yeah, let's go ahead... Let's go ahead and put speed upgrades in the, uh, in the golden fuser. Then maybe we can uh, worry about that. Yeah, I mean this is gonna take a while, but it, it'll tell me it'll tell me when the netherite's done. So uh, yeah, I'll be uh, I'll be back as I'll be back as soon as uh, everything's good to go for uh, the next tier of heart canister. I'm also crafting some uh, resonant integral components for my auto crafting thermal machines because holy crap, these things are slow right now. Like I like I'm literally tick accelerating this just so I could get the lumium. But uh, it, even even then, it's not fast enough. My God, I guess I could use these three flux leakage amplifiers in here to get this to go faster. Oh, but then it can't accept power fast enough because it's being tick accelerated. That's not good. She's gonna have to take these out for the time being. Oh my God, 
No, not that. Alright, how's this doing? Uh, yep, we're crafting the signalum. Alright. <laughs> Take more power, please. I need more power. Alright. Uh, be right back. There we go. Now we have resonant integral components for all of these, which means I can make resonant integral components for the rest of my machines even faster, which is perfect. Definitely needed that. All right. Uh, so my netherite should be done by now. Yep. That is a lot of netherite, man. All right. So we could get the blue heart canisters. We can add them to my heart amulet. And yeah, that's pretty uh, pretty insane amount of health. And then we could also put them in here. This will do 74. Oh, wait, that's not right. 94 because of sharpness 10. And, it, and so, yeah, that's pretty good. That is a pretty good amount of damage, which means which means my my sword will be killing a lot, a lot faster. That's gonna be insanely cool. How's my uh, lithium doing? 7,000. All right, well, that's going to take a while before it gets to 10,000. So, yeah. Oh, my God. Again, the Starbuckles. Where are these Starbuckles coming from? I have no idea where the Starbuckles are coming from. It's just, they, they seem to show up out of nowhere. And also, what happened over here? Well, that's, uh, huh. Yeah, how did how does a tree keep growing outside of the, outside of the farm? Like, this doesn't even, this isn't even in the farm. I don't, I don't get it. Huh. Let's just do that, just so, just so that way we can, uh, chop it all down. There you go. I have I don't even know how that happened. It shouldn't be happening, but it, but it is happening. Chat, do you, does anyone, or not chat, why why am I talking like I'm streaming? Uh, anyone in the comments, do you, do, does anyone know why that keeps happening with uh, with my, uh, uh, does anyone know why that keeps happening with uh, with my uh, tree farm? Let me, because uh, let me know, it, it's extremely annoying and I want it to be fixed. Alright, I think, I think we're going to go ahead and call it for this episode. I mean, we got to, uh, got to check out some of the new toys in Cognitium and, uh, and, I fully upgrade my health to the blue health, uh, the blue heart canister. So, yeah. All right, Alrighty, guys, I think that'll do it for this episode of Curves of Minecraft. Hope you all enjoyed uh, a, a few Ender Dragon fights, checking out some toys in Cognition, and getting lots of netherite for the blue heart canisters. Stay tuned next time. We'll probably either continue with Batania, uh, because, because, like, Mythic Botany is a thing, or maybe we'll get started with, like, Pneumatic Craft or something. But we'll see. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later!